Shalom family, once again, you're welcome. Welcome to this amazing, great, awesome world and awesome session. It's your sister, Dr. Iran. I love you so much. I bring you a timely word from the Lord. You know, like I always on a daily basis, God will give a word to his people. Hallelujah. Your first time to click on my video, returning viewers, returning subscribers. God bless you all in the name of Jesus. Now, I have this word which God laid in my heart. You know, I saw these people weeping. I saw this book crying. So much weeping. <laughs> and when I asked the Lord, but what is this? God told me they are weeping because they lost you. They are weeping because they lost you. Hmm. Some people can be very manipulative. Really manipulative. You know, they use their emotions, they use everything that they have to make you feel like they were so desperate about you. You know, they're so desperate, you know, to be with you. Like without you, they're going to die and all of that. Meanwhile, they were just manipulating you so that you going to remain their slave. You know, as this song says, I'm no longer a slave to, to sin. I am a child of God. I hear this, this, this veil, this spell that they casted on you to keep you bound close to them. You know, you don't even have a life of your own. You find yourself living people's lives. Your decisions, you can't take decisions on your own because you're just like, ah, how are they going to do now? You find yourself living their lives, working under their decisions and all of that. And... Each time you make an attempt to break out, they will use manipulative words, emotions to bound you down. But this time around, you didn't go. God says you are no longer a slave to that bondage. The spell that was casted over you is broken completely. And you are living to take off. You are living for your flight. You are living to start a new, a new life altogether. And this is why they are weeping. They wanted you to remain under their, you know, obscured uh, manipulations. But the Lord has revealed it. He has spilled it off. God says that step that you are about to take, that new ground you are about to break, He is going to be with you. It's going to be like a well. Like the Bible says in the book of Genesis chapter 26, verse 21 to 35. It said, Isaac dug another well and water came out. 